Hey everybody, uh, I am not your host Warpath. If he was playing all of these himself, he would probably kill over. Anyway, today we're going to be looking at Code of the Burger King. I really know nothing about this hack, uh, apart from this title screen, and some instructions I got from the hack developer, which said I should use some items and stat boosters in prep. So we're gonna do that. Um, let's just take a moment to really appreciate this. Not, not like I'm gonna take a moment though, because you can just go back, rewind a video, pause the screen if you really want to soak it in. Anyway, uh, chapter eight, in America. And so that is what faces us. Nice explanation, guy. So to recap, okay, that's useful, recap. You're a band of noble thieves, known as the Dandelion, singular, and the American army is preparing for a siege right outside your door. Very elegantly summarized, thank you. Anyway, we'd appreciate some help fighting them off since, you know, we're helping you find the Temple of Whopper and all that jazz. Very well, let well, us hope it's not too much longer. It's starting, boss. Kemp finally sent the order. The manor is officially under siege. Huh, thought I'd be more pumped. Well, whatever. It's a go time! Definitely how you're supposed to say that, right? I'll prepare our troops. May we all survive this day. <clears throat> See some, uh... Some NES tile sets over there? Or SNES, I don't really remember. Let's take a look at the units real quick. The Burger King. Uh, no relation to the Black Knight. Alright. Uh, this hack has skills. I'm not gonna look at the stats too much, just because I don't know what the enemy stats are like. So, it's not really meaningful to spend too much time on these. Okay, we got some leadership stars going on. Uh, I like the savior skill a lot. Hughes here. He makes money. I actually don't know how important money is in this hack. Um, <clears throat> it'll be up to the player to find that one out. Big, big chungus, big chungus, big chungus. Wow, alright. That's pretty funny. I mean... Ironically, that's pretty funny. Okay. You know, I still don't really know how Provoke works in FE8 skill systems, but I guess we'll find out. Alright. Uh-huh, we got a priest here. I don't recognize this icon. Let me just... Combat experience gain is doubled. This, does this have, like... Does this game have miss experience? Or is it just, like, a joke? Like, it doubles the one experience you get. Another aggravation. See, now, how do these play with each other? Soldier. Soldier. Okay, that's fair. Rebecca... Alright, we got a good selection of, like, crossover units. So, I think that's what we're going for here. There's some sort of, like, a meme crossover -y sort of thing. But enough about that, let's look at the items. Uh, okay. Oh yeah! I was told that there were these B-side things, uh, which can be used uh, on level 10 plus unpromoted units, and can be found by standing on suspicious tiles. So if you play this hack yourself, you know, uh, give that a roll. Now, this B-side is on Chaos Reigns. That's extremely worrisome. Dalvin, so I think we're supposed to use it on him. Nice. I... Okay, so I think it's like a second seal type thing. If it doesn't nerf experience gain like the second seal does, that's really broken. Because he, he, he went back to level 1, you know? That's like wild. Okay. Uh, foot leg. Perfect. I like held items. You can do a lot of funny stuff with like trade chains. I was told there would be a Master Seal. Let's check the convoy. Ooh! Convoy's stock, baby! Alright. Uh, man. I don't have editorial control over this video, so I don't know where all of the, um, timestamps are gonna be, if there are any. But I'm gonna have some fun in preps, so if y'all wanna just, like, skip ahead a little bit, you know, totally understandable. Placebo drop? What is this? It would be really funny if it actually doesn't do anything. Give me a second, I'm gonna give it to this guy. 
<coughs> okay, it's not actually placebo. Well, I mean, it could be, you know, like, your growths just increase because you think they would. Alright, we got a lot of stat boosters to go through here. Let's take a look. Uh, okay, so you see here, Sephiron has only 32 health. I think health is pretty in play in this. Yeah. Oh, Charlo. Charlo's got low health. So, in the spirit of this game, we're just gonna give him the angelic robe here. Well, I guess the spirit of the game would be probably giving him, like, three angelic robes, which I thought we might have. But, uh, it's alright. We can make up for it by giving him the energy rings, too. Wait, that raises strength! Not magic, they're separate ones. So, of course, that's what we're gonna do. Okay. That, that's enough Charlowing. I don't even remember what item he actually had. Like, uh... I'll just give him something random. Foot, leg, and spirit ring. There we go. <clears throat> That'll be useful. Um... Hop on guard for this guy with zero luck. All right, that makes sense. When I saw the hop on guard, I suspected this might be the case. Uh, who am I gonna want to use? Uh, you know, like every other uh, Game Boy Advance Fire Emblem sim, I love Priscilla to death. So we're gonna give her uh, some luck, actually, and probably a speed wing. I don't know why I would do that. Watching preps might hurt your soul a little bit. Uh, I am warning you to skip ahead to the game, but I'm gonna be doing a lot of dumb stuff here. Like, oh yeah, okay, so we have an axe guy here, right? 12 skill nets? Is that a lot for an axe guy? Yeah, our sword guy has 22. I keep reading, like, the magic is the skill. Okay, yeah, 12 is actually pretty... Priscilla only has 9 skill? Time to fix that. Uh-huh. I can't promote Priscilla, so that was actually completely useless. And, okay. Axe guy. Axe guy gets the body ring. Oh yeah, oh yeah. We didn't go full Gonzales out here. <coughs> what else do I have left? Resistance? Okay, our Lord's resistance isn't that great. And I don't want the run to end because I'm bad. Because that means I'll have to re-record. And that's like bad for me, you know? So let's give him the talismans. Okay, what else do we have left? The speed wing. Uh, okay. You're supposed to give things like speed wings to people who are kinda good, but need to beat a threshold. I don't know what that means at all, so I'm just gonna fall into the new trap of giving the speed wing to the slowest person, which is Charlo! Hey, 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 this could help prevent him from getting doubled, you know? Like, I'm not a complete idiot. I think. Yeah, I'm gonna give him the spirit ring. Why not? Nice, uh, staff icons, by the way. Look at this. The staves, the staves do the same things, but, you know, it's nice that the icons are different. Okay, okay. Question. Can we promote our lord in this? Can we B-side our lord? Okay, no, we can't. That would have been really funny. But can we promote the lord with Master Seal? Nope. Okay, that's fair. Uh, Sephran is level 14. That's enough for, uh... Ooh, B-side is risky, you know. I don't have, uh... Any other tomes here. So if he goes into a... Okay, he's got some... Do I have any dark tomes? Alright. Risking it for the biscuit. Risking it for the biscuit. If it doesn't make sense, you have to do it. That's just how things work in America! <laughs> I really like the B-side music. Uh, the next... Did he just... Uh-oh. It's always good to have more healers, you know? Uh... Do we have any more guys to B-side? Hugh! Okay, I'm really gonna regret... I'm gonna regret not using Sneeze, that's the thing. I really wanna use Sneeze. Alright, Mathis, 
Nobody cares if something bad happens to Mathis. B-side! Wait a second, he can still use the Paragon Lance? Oh, because it's a preferred weapon. Yo, sick. All right, all right. I am a tactical genius. Look at this. Look at this. If they had like a pirate lance animation just for Mathis Lance, I would be tickled, but I don't think they do. And honestly, I wouldn't expect anyone to uh, think about something dumb like that. Uh, oh, this means we can give her like a killer lance. Hell yeah. Okay, Soldier is not high level enough to meme. Sail. Okay. Okay, you know what? We're actually gonna promote someone. We're gonna promote someone normally. <clears throat> Whenever I see the Berserker sprite, I always just think about, like, guys with huge bodies. What the heck? Look at those group. Uh, not group. Promotion gains. You know what I mean. Actually, I just promoted everyone. What was I thinking? Uh, okay. Is there anyone left that can meet? Ah, oh, Hugh. Fire, sneeze, poison. Okay, I have to sneeze on somebody. It's just like, you can't not sneeze on him. So that B-side's gonna have to go and use, unfortunately. Let's go, Hugh. <coughs> This is a non-branching promotion game, so, you know, just keep that in mind. And this is also a very, very uh, sweet promotion bonus game. I'm really running low on staves to actually, like, justify all my staff nonsense, so... I'm only playing this one chapter anyway, I'm just gonna use Physic if I have to heal with Charlo. And I won't have to heal with Charlo, because... Oh, interesting, so, it looks like the base weapons are all infinite use in this game. Uh, I saw that on, yeah, the Iron Bow, but the Lightning Tome before I made it completely unusable. I mean, mean to take a look at this. Ranged Physical Sword. <coughs> What's the Paragon Lance do? For someone who desperate- wow. Alright. Well, he does need it, because he's a pirate now. I'm gonna save this. I'm not gonna save this. All men, move out. It's time for us to rise up, gamers. Wait, where is everyone? Where's Salem? You sent him out to get groceries. He hasn't yet returned. I imagine he'll turn up near the desert soon enough. All right. Well, I'm sure he wouldn't mind if I took his college fund to buy gear. What about the dancers? Last I saw, one of them was preparing for battle. That weird, genetically spliced one. Right. Man, I'm terrible at this planning thing. If I know we'd be fighting Kemp, I'd have actually gotten our forces ready. Anywho, let's rock. We'll catch up with the others later. We've got two choices here. Hold out or take the fight to him. You can guess what I prefer, but you're the boss, Mr. Burger Man. I actually, I don't know what he would prefer, but he's bad at planning, so he'd probably want us to rush the boss. Let's do it. Here, take this for good luck. This is my absolute jam. Listen to it sometime. Supposedly, it has magical abilities that can impart massive boons at a cost. <coughs> anyway, good luck out there. Macho man. I thought it was gonna be B-side to be honest. Hmm, is that a desert over there? I have heard stories of legendary blades hiding within the sands. Where's the desert? I have to get into the desert? Oh my god, it looks like such a pain. I really want to read the description for American. You're in America now. Oh yeah, so if you skipped ahead here because I said that I was doing preps and you could skip those, don't actually skip those. Uh, there's some pretty interesting stuff that goes on there. Look at that icon. Look at that icon. Now, now we are truly in America. The ultimate American patriot. <laughs> Alright, so aggravation is like part functional, part meme in this hack, which I really like. That's strength 27. Alright, this guy's gonna rip me to shreds. Which, you know, I'm okay with. Here we have Kern. 
has a dancer harem and child slaves. Why is he a good... You know, this does come up pretty often. Uh, okay. Steal plus. So he can steal a lot of stuff. I should have saved the body ring for him. Gosh darn it. Oh, intrude. Here we go. Extremely cool! I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna do a quick, uh, Rudy Trudy, uh, promote on him. Why? Because who doesn't love, uh, who doesn't love Swordmasters? <laughs> also, who doesn't love the, uh, promotion games in this game? Like, look at that! Okay, I can probably fight Kemp now if I had to. I'm pretty sure I have to defend this too, right? I mean, I'm not actually sure, but... What's the bow range in this game? What? Oh, it's a Ballista. Okay, okay. I was like, wait a second there. I I'm expecting, you know, 2-2 two -two as bow range, or 2-3. Okay, it's just regular 2-2. Two -two. That's fine. Uh, will I die? Oh. Yeah, no. I just have to attack from here. I can do whatever I want, because... Ooh, look at these numbers! Alright. Uh, this guy can't actually survive two hits. So... Easy. Get sailed on. Ooh, Phenol Cavalier. Excellent. Nice speed rank axes. Alright, so if I stay here, I won't get my, uh, worst guy destroyed. I think these are the, uh, uh, if I'm wrong, you know, I apologize, uh, but I think these are, like, the salvage animations, right? It's pretty swift. Uh, slick. Alright, I'd like to heal him. Do this, okay, yeah, this hack has the, uh, you press select and you can see the enemy ranges. And I forgot about that. Uh, Charlotte can take, like, one hit. Okay, so I want to get... What the heck? Alright, so this guy's just gonna be annoying. Alright, looks like everyone hits, like, a truck in this hack. Yeah, okay, so... <coughs> That's pleasant. I didn't see a bolting or anything that I could do to that guy, so I'm just gonna have to keep people healthy with Charlotte or something. Burger King can't... Oh, here we go. Not actually a fantastic idea. Rapier? Can I get away with that, though? Absolutely not. Oh, but, okay. Whoever's standing here won't get attacked again, so... I can get with this. And then, uh, we'll just, uh, sort this guy. Perfect. <coughs> okay, yeah, so she's out of danger. He's in danger, but not from these stationary guys, so that's fine. And now this frees me up to heal, uh... Dalvin with Charlo. Preferably from somewhere where... Who did I give the... MP divided by 2. Okay, that's not a lot of range. Whatever, he's in a bar, so he'll be fine. You know, despite being a meme hack, I am definitely suitably uh, intimidated by the gameplay presented thus far. So we'll send Chungus this way, and I'll have my other big meaty guy, the king himself, go this way. What does this do? Raises strength, lowers speed. So his speed is 14, which actually I don't think is like... okay. We take a look at the speeds around. Archer doubles him. This guy. Let's not. I'm not really about lowering speed. 
just uh, as a personal thing, you know? Okay, so we got Sephirin the Healer. One of my uh, bigger blunders already. <laughs> so who's supposed to go to the desert? Dalvin, right? And someone else is possibly getting groceries, which I guess means I have to go spend their college funds over there at the vendor. I think that's what that means anyway, I'll give it a try. <laughs> See who I get killed? Oh! Alright, so I don't want to get, like, destroyed from behind. Let's, uh, maybe I'll send Mathis back to deal with him. Because, you know, whatever, it's just Mathis. I totally calculated the range on that and had the iron bow out. Chunk is doubles? Alright. Oh, we got a longbow. Ooh, one crate. Let's go, fellas. Time to race some hell. Leave no stone unturned and no house unburned. Uh, okay. I think... We can turn off animations for... Let's check the Burger King animation out, and then we'll probably turn off animations just to, like, uh... You know, not have everyone sit through all that. Uh, yeah, he can tank stuff. Wait, is this gonna get me killed? 30... Uh, that'll be fine, probably. As long as I don't get double crit, but you know, where are the odds of that? Never mind. Let's, let's not just die immediately. <coughs> I see a few ways to avoid dying immediately. Oh, hold on. Yeah, two-range sword. Alright, that's pretty cool. Alright, I'm good to turn off animations now. Wait, hold on, we gotta see Charlo. No, we already saw that. Yeah, alright. I'll obviously turn them on for like boss fights and stuff, you know? But I think a lot of these are um, some of the uh, cooler, like, uh, community assets out there. But I haven't seen anything that was like totally unique yet. Let's see. So we're gonna put Mathis over here. And you know what? If he dies, he dies. Vulnerabilities restore 20 health, which is good because stats are super inflated, and if they didn't restore 20 health, they'd be useless. Uh, I think we can just start smashing away at this. I'll leave, like, getting to the desert to this team over here. So... Yeah. Let's just smash. <clears throat> Wait a second, was that a double HP growth? 145, dang, alright, so Chungus is really big, like preposterously so. And these guys have 1 2 range. What I'm gonna do is trade out this iron bow here. And Axis. Alright, nice. <coughs> okay, uh, I think these guys are gonna be moving down this way. Uh, I think they have a little bit more ground to cover. I'll send Priscilla with them, even though I moved her this way to begin with, and then I'll send Sephiroth over here as the dealer. <coughs> and since they already have Hugh as well, I might as well send uh, Charlotte this way as well. Support? Oh. For your... <laughs> this might be spoilers, let me just skip past this. Uh, you saw nothing. But yeah, I think that's just like the regular support conversation. Otherwise, I'm very confused. Oh, he minces these guys. Like, absolutely. Uh, he also gets minced, so let's not actually say we did. I could fight this guy, though. 
with a silver lance because we are definitely not conserving resources here. No, sir. At least the accuracy is good on, like, fast guys. Is this, like, a DS avoid? Or is it just, like, really high skill? I'm not really sure. <coughs> Hansbo grants Canto Plus. Okay. 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 Well, you know, it is guaranteed to hit. Man, I was excited about Rebecca for like half a second. Wait, let's sneeze on him. Can't skip this. All right, that's a pretty funny animation for that. It's, I think, the dragon breath, but it's green, so you know. It's pretty good. I'm glad I saw that. <clears throat> Priscilla this way, and... Crude. I think... Let's have him go this way. He can start spending those college funds or something. out what's in that desert today, boys. My first death came off too soon. Is Mathis gonna get doubled too? Okay, no, he doubles. Oh. Wait. Linhart's a dancer? My dance charms and reinvigorates all, and I'd be delighted to show it off. Why are we but fleeting specks of dust on the wind? Is there purpose to our lives? Can we define our purpose? Why was I born? Why was I made? Oh dear god, answer me! Why have I been cursed with life? I can tell the creator really likes that Final Fantasy music. Okay, so we got some stat boosts. Likes existentialism. Oh, okay, so this tells you what skills they learn at certain levels. There's a benefit to leveling dancer, my god. Counter! Counter, okay, that's a really funny skill to have. Uh, although, with the stats in this game being how they are, I don't think Linhard is going to be surviving any uh, attacks of the physical or magical persuasion at this level. So let's, let's have him dance safely for now. We're gonna... That's gonna be a dead Mathis. Hold on. No, that's, that's not actually worth it. I wanted to see if he had a Lance animation, but I'm pretty sure he doesn't. <clears throat> He's gaining mad levels, though, because of that uh, second ceiling. Or B siding. <clears throat> oh, wait! I'll turn on Linhard Dance next uh, turn, I promise. If I don't get him killed by accident, you know. Alright, we should be able to break through here now, I think, with relative ease. I think I can... These guys are level 2 promoted Americans, that's kinda scary. That is a big killer axe, like, damage range, you know? Er, crit range. That's like almost reliable. I'm gonna pretend it's reliable. Oh, hell yeah. Okay, so this guy has Seal Sword and Elfire, 15 speed. <clears throat> From what I've seen, yeah, no one's really gonna get doubled by that. So, if I can just wipe out these armors here, I'll be good. No lucky miss, but that's okay. I wasn't really counting on it this time. <laughs> oh, 
Okay, and I can have Sephirin heal. Is that gonna get him out? Speed 17. Uh, this guy do that much damage? No. 32. Let's see if any. Yeah, he's fine. He's fine. We're gonna heal Chungus. And then Charlo is gonna hide behind. And Physic Crane. And we're good! Alright. East side is safe for now. We can move on to more pressing matters, especially since I already got someone killed on the uh, west side. <coughs> so we got some Cavaliers here. They're Sword Calves. No, Sword Cav, Lance Cav, and Sword Cav. But I don't think they're too threatening. It's just this guy with his uh, 28 speed and 31 skill. Okay, so stat caps go past 30, for sure. Does this guy have Vantage? No, just... Look at that. I don't know what I was thinking, like sending anyone into his attack range. It would have to be Big Chungus. I think you're supposed to deploy Big Chungus to the west in this case. Or not deploy, but like move him there. Oh, well actually you could change where people are deployed. I just didn't in the prep screen. I think I'm bad at Fire Emblem. Okay. Uh, he'll be fine doing whatever. So we might as well start moving him downwards here. Uh, we got a rapier here, so... Okay, I'm gonna check speed this time. 24. 16. So he's gonna get double. But does that matter? 27. 11. He can survive a doubling, but probably not the attack that comes after it. So let's not do that. <clears throat> not to get someone who can stand there and take that hit. It's not these guys. This tile looks like... No, it's just a fort. I guess I'll just mass everyone up here and then, you know, attack the sword guys that come. No longbow for me. No Sarah. Is that fort under attack? Yes, it is. And this guy's range ends here, so this is safe, I think. Wait, is that a savable house? Oh no! I have made a grave mistake. And now I am not sure I can rectify it. But hey, soldier groups. I'm pretty sure I just got soldier killed too. Don't forget me. Okay, no one ever forgets the playable soldier, so you will live on in our memories for certain. Ooh, okay, that's mean. That ballista is mean. It's a mean pants. Still not resetting. I can do this. Okay, so this is actually a village. If you are like me and you haven't really played the, uh, old generation games, uh, bear that in mind, because you don't want to lose that. <laughs> oh dear. I really hope the uh, designer of the hack appreciates incompetence, or else they're going to be mighty angry at this let's play. I can support again? Nice. I mean, I'm not gonna, but you know. <laughs> Well, I will get somebody to stand in the desert. This I promise. Even if it means everyone else has to die for me to do it. 66%. Yeah, 66 is basically 100, you know. Right, so that's 29. And 29 plus... Okay, so that's actually... 
24 total. Yeah, okay. <clears throat> I'm not completely awful at math. Rebecca goes here. And thus, he is free to do this. We're gonna be suffering some casualties here. Also, I'm pretty sure I still have Sneeze equipped, which is not optimal. Oh! Water Walk! Wait. <clears throat> he doesn't just have Water Walk, he has Acrobat. I can just go and do this. It's crazy. Good night. Ah, alright. Pay attention to skills, kids. It'll help you not die as badly as I did. I would like to not expose myself to too much uh, pain here. She's a little bit on the weaker side. Defensively, at least. Can I possibly- okay, big chungus coming through. It is really funny that these guys are slow enough for chungus to double. Linhard dancing animation. We're doing it. Nice. I don't know what I was expecting. Boom! Lucky hit! That's what I was expecting. Whoa! That's a lot of... Right, I forgot. Everyone in this hits like a truck, so... <clears throat> if you leave a squishy unit exposed to more than one enemy, you've, uh, you've done it, you know? It's over. Okay, I don't feel too bad about this one because I never used you anyway. Why me? This is all wrong. Dan, will I never see you again? I feel a little bad about that one. <coughs> of course. Typical Pern, getting into a fight unprepared. Well, I've got to get these groceries back. Can't even afford to waste time fighting, not if I'm alone. <coughs> okay, so who's Swiss Recruit? Do they have the, uh... Oh, it's a one-way talk conversation. Is it Pern? Please. Please, no! Oh! Oh, I have made a grave mistake. Can Trude do it? Trude can do it! I have not made a grave mistake. I just have to not get Trude killed. Which I can handle. I can handle this. I'm, I'm not a complete failure. Oh, who am I kidding? But I can at least get Trude there alive. I'm confident of my ability to do so. Uh... This project is kind of scary. Confidence wins. 66%! Well, it was bound to fail eventually. That was possibly the worst juncture for that failure to occur, though. Uh, he's got 23 health, this guy does 37, and he's got... Does this guy have a hand axe? No. <coughs> nice. Yeah, the plus 30 crit on promoted uh, swords and axe guys, and maybe halberdiers, I don't know if they're in this tag, is really nice. Do these guys move? No. Does this guy move? Yes. Does the boss move? No. Okay, silver sword, easy. 
Let me just get out my... Sword Reaver! Of course. being like preposterous so we're just gonna yeah oh i got it in one he's got seven moves okay <clears throat> and then yeah everything here's safe so i can just take yeah. all is not lost and then i can try to have him draw a hit i guess or i can just do this <laughs> yeah, okay. So, it's gonna be him versus the world, I guess. No double. Thank goodness. Power of the Sword Reaver. <clears throat> oh, what is that? What? Longbow Warrior. Okay. That is mighty scary, and also, why didn't he go for Linhard? That could be bad. Okay, so <clears throat> he can't really attack very well right now. So now is the time to get in a cheeky kill and get out. Ooh, it's not gonna work, is it? <clears throat> This guy doesn't reach here, so maybe that's an idea. Now the question is, is there a safe zone for Lin? And the answer is no. So, it was nice knowing you. Oh, I see. Mathis took the hit because he has provoked. Should be able to get close enough soon to get this recruitment off. I'm willing to land an 82, or I could just not be a dummy and do this. Salem. Ah, good to see you, Crude. I presume it's happening? Yeah, will it be too much to ask for your help? We can get groceries after the battle, I'm sure. Very well. Let us overcome this darkness. Okay, yeah. <clears throat> I just want to check, you know, sometimes people write, like, one support conversation, but not the rest. Hemern? Okay. That's fast. Nice. I dig it. And this guy's got a steel axe, so if I just move... Here. Nice works perfect for this actually. Hey, there's a village here. Oh yeah! Dark Mage can use staves in this. Uh I wonder if those went back to supply. Let me check. Okay, dead people items don't go back to supply. That's really good to know actually. This is a dragon axe. Why is it named like this? Is it made of dragons? Does it kill dragons? Why not a dragon slayer then? We already have horse and armor slayers. What's so special about dragons? Why won't anyone hear my cry? 
You know, the man raises some valid points. It's like Gashio's rant in JoJo. Alright, uh, you know, I've been finishing people off with prayer and it's pretty fun. Rapier and all. Let's do it again. Look at all this stuff to steal. I'm excited. It's gonna make me feel better about the fact that, you know, I let everyone die because I'm bad. Spear Brave Axe. So, do not go near these guys. Got it. Understood. This is going to take some doing. So I think I'll... 46, and that's 37. I'm pretty sure... Yeah, no one actually doubles a big chunk of which is nice. I'm going to javelin it and heal, and I'm fine. <clears throat> B-siding Sephiram, easily the possibly only good decision I've made so far. And that was a lance, so we'll just meet a lance with a lance. Really hope that a uh, house can hold out. <clears throat> it's just Mathis there. Does not uh, exactly inspire uh, confidence. All our hopes and dreams lie with Chungus. As it should be. Yeah, I expected that. Very cool. Is this guy gonna... Okay. No. I am low on time. If any of these guys go for it, this thing, I'm done. With that in mind, the warrior cannot, which means I can really do nothing about that. How do I stop this guy? I think my only option is to just go in here and then vulnerary and hope for the best. <clears throat> and then we'll have to just prepare to deal with Ken. I say as if that's, you know, easy, possible feasible in any way. That's not bad. Cross out looking at chest next turn. Necessary. Nice. Okay, and then we can just switch his weapon back with one of the clerics. Sephiroth, OP. We'll go. Which one does he have power hit with? Iron Bow, easy. I mean, I should have remembered that, but you know. Alright. Does Kemp get faster when he attacks? The ultimate American patriot. But he's not faster on the attack, which is very un-American. I can barrier Chungus. I don't need to, but it's an option, you know? Okay. Pretty sure the desert thing only works with, uh, Dalvin, but... You know, it's like, worth a shot. Might as well lose some other guys, see what comes of it. Alright, I'm supposed to go shopping too. Let's do that. Math is doing work. You, drawing your weapon? 
You truly believe you can bring this fight to me? Stupid bitch. Prepare to die. In America! Oh boy. Alright, yeah, this guy's going down. There's a house up there. Oh, that's what the uh, brigands are going for. Mathis lives! Mathis OP. Dragon Lance is not bad. It's not good either, so there you go. I mean, not in this situation. Hey, boys, is that an arena I spy? Uh. I was thinking there might be like groceries here or something and that'd be like the secret, but I guess not. Okay, I'll, I'll press B out as fast as possible if something goes wrong. Is that the Rocky music? Alright, I really like that. Never punished. I'm really showing off all the hack has to offer. Alright, sword me. Dang it! Sword me. Okay, it really does have to be Dalvin, huh? Can you tell if the door is closed on the villagers? You can! Look, see? There's a little pixel near, like, the mid-bottom left-ish. It's like, open door. Closed door. I was looking for that. I was like, can you tell if you visited a village already? You know, if you're brain dead like me and you can't remember. Spear? Okay. Keep that in mind, guys. If you play the spear yourselves, top right one has a spear. Very useful generically for spears. Can I slap him? That is a bad idea. So we're gonna play it safe here. We're gonna. Is absolutely playing it safe. Nothing safer. If you have to hop on guard. Hey, no, I'm not saving items. So here we go. This is what we call not safe. Let's do it. Oh my god. When you when you play the sack yourself, don't play like me. Actually, one thing you should definitely do is B-side Mathis, because that's really funny. Wait, you went for Chungus because of the Berserk! Okay. I'm pretty sure this hack has the, uh, not Berserk, Provoke. No! No! I can't die. I am perfection. Ronald, save me. Alright, that's probably a good hint as to who one of the major villains is. Their assault has finally stopped. At last, we can finally rest. Indeed, but not for long. We must keep moving towards the Temple of Whopper. Okay. Um, so. Things to note. Um, this hack can be kind of hard because people hit like trucks. So, don't go in and expect your squishies to tank hits like I did. Because I am dumb and did not t check stats. I explicitly said in preps... I should check stats when it comes to the enemies just to see how they compare, and I totally forgot about that. So, 
that's bad uh, on me. Um, other than that, you know, despite being a meme hack, it does seem to have like an actual plot of sorts. And it isn't like inundated in memes, you know, like everyone is, has like a, how do I say this? They're sort of like treating the setting seriously, even if what they're saying is not necessarily serious, which I like. I also like that Big Chungus is a character. Why? Because my wife really likes Big Chungus and I have Big Big Chungus on my cell phone for when we take long car drives. Um, I'm actually surprised there are not more memes in the cast. Like, you know, there's the Black Knight, which is obviously great, and there's Big Chungus, and there's Charlo. But besides that, you know, uh, it did actually seem to be just like a, uh, relatively Fire Emblem crossover-y-ish cast. So I assume most of the memeing comes from the plot and also Kemp, because Kemp is a meme. Um, I wonder if Americans feature in more chapters than this one, because it is fun to fight Americans. I say as an American. Uh, I like the music choices, personally, because I like Final Fantasy music too. I really like the uh, addition of the B-sides as like a second seal type thing, um, especially because of their random nature. I recommend just doing them all blind and then saving immediately after so no take backs because I think that is the spirit in which it is meant to be done. Uh, and last thing, the side objectives do actually seem fairly challenging. And as you might notice by the color, this hack is locked into hard mode. I don't know if that's a mechanical choice because of some of the enemy scaling things, or if it's a stylistic one to say, hey, despite being called Code of the Burger King, this hack might be a little hard. So keep that in mind as well. I look forward to the release of this one. Uh, and I also look forward to uh, the uh, memes that will inevitably follow uh, should people start playing it and commenting in the uh, thread. So with that, I think we are approaching the one hour mark. This was pretty fun. And uh, I'm looking forward to see where it goes from here. Cheerio.